For those of you keeping up with Google local changes over the last five or six years, you may have gotten confused by all the name changes. Some of you have received calls from solicitors telling you you can get to the top of Google, but they don't explain what that means and what you're really getting. And that is one of the most common questions I get. What am I really getting? When I started my business in 2006, the local search pages were called maps and they had red dots which represented the businesses. The maps were a mystery to me until 2007 when I helped a customer with hers and realized what an incredible marketing asset the maps were. Sometime in 2009, Google decided to separate the businesses from the maps function and they created a new platform called Places, a new directory to manage the business listings that had continued to show up on the maps. This confused a lot of people at the time, but slowly businesses adjusted. July 1st, 2012, they made more changes, this time making a lot of waves by integrating Google Places with Google+. Plus. Google Plus is Google's social platform to connect with friends, associates, and to stay up to date with the latest trends. Now that Google's social platform is interconnected with their local searches, Google will increase their activity on Google Plus. Consumers will see what their friends have liked and gauge businesses better with a new review system by Zagat. For business owners who aren't already taking advantage of Google Plus Places, the time to start is now because this is the new Yellow Pages book, but with reviews directing people to quality businesses.